Yeah, these are just some of the items that I've purchased. So I will let you know what size I got them in, how much I paid for them and how much they would have been because everything that I purchased had discount and my checking points taken off. So we'll just get straight on into it. So the first item that I picked up was this um, burgundy purple blazer dress. This is like velvet. It is, yeah, such good quality. It's fully lined, double breasted. I got this in a medium. Just double checking. Yeah, I got this in a size medium. It should have been $27.99, which would be honestly, uh, it would just be worth it because it is honestly such good quality. But I got it for £9.90. Now I got this a while ago and I did actually wear this on Christmas day. Um, and I felt a little too bougie really because we was on our own. But I like dressing up for Christmas and yeah this is definitely going to get worn again as soon as we can go out and do something because it definitely needs to be seen by other people so yeah really really pleased if anything's available i'll link it all down in the description bar if not i'm so sorry um but yeah that's the first item So the next item is this uh, sweatshirt, so I sized up to a large in the sweatshirt and I'm so glad I did, I wish I'd sized up a few more to be honest because it fits but I'd like it to be a little bit, um, yeah just a bit more oversized to be honest but the quality of this is unreal. It is so fluffy. I've purchased um, sweatshirts before and they've been a bit thin, but this one is a proper sweatshirt um, and it's embroidered front so it won't come off very easily. Um, but yeah, really pleased with this. It should have been 13 49 and again, I think that this is well worth 13 49 but with my discounts, I got it for six pounds thirty-seven pence. So my next item again is another blazer dress. Um, if you follow me on Instagram, you will have seen this already because I actually wore this on Valentine's night. Um, obviously, it didn't go anywhere, but we had a nice romantic night. And I dressed up and I wore this with um, a little belt, well no actually quite a thick belt on and my knee high boots um, but yeah so versatile this because obviously you can wear it as a blazer dress but you can also just wear it as a blazer as it gets a bit warmer. This is not as good quality as the first one but I'm super happy with it and it cost me 7.22. I got it in a size medium and it should have been 15.99. But I was pleased with it with my discounts. The next item I have for you is this faux leather baby doll style dress. I got this in a size medium. It was £5.52, I'm looking down because the price is on my phone, and it should have been £19.99 and it doesn't smell. <laughs> Some of faux leather really smells, this doesn't, and it actually feels really nice quality. So yeah, it's been really on trend, faux leather, anything, faux leather, trousers, pants, coats, etc. Um, so I thought I would grab this. I then purchased this teddy type 
jacket. It's sort of an aviator style. It is the softest, coziest thing. Completely the wrong colour, but oh, it's so cozy. It's fluffy on the inside and on the outside. And this was 7.63. Should have been 22.99. And I got it in a size large and I'm so happy that I got it in a large because I can get extra layers and be extra cosy in this. Yeah, I could go to bed in it. It's just, yeah, I cannot say how cosy it is because, yeah, I wish you could feel. But yeah, I highly recommend this. Okay, so it is this dress. I got this again in a size medium. It is quite thin, so it'll be ideal for the spring. It was £5.10, which is a bargain. It should have been £14.99, and I probably wouldn't have paid that because it is thin. But for £5.10, it is a complete bargain. And the last item is again another dress, no surprises. It's this mixed animal print dress now this one is a jersey fabric so it's slightly better quality it feels nice and soft i've got this in a medium again and it comes with its own little belt five pounds 52 absolute steal and it was originally 13.99 so that's everything I've got for you today. I hope you enjoyed this video and I really hope that you will come back and join me in the next one, which will probably be another vintage haul. Um, but yeah, I'm really enjoying doing these videos. I really would like to do some styling videos and I've also got an alterations video coming soon, but I just need to sort my camera setup out, which I'm getting there. Um, yeah, so I hope I see you in the next one. Bye.